A long, long time ago, in a land halfway around the world called Palestine, there was a husband and a wife named Mary and Joseph, and they were expecting a baby. Beginning, there were signs that the child Mary was carrying was to be very special. An angel appeared to her and said, You will have a baby. His name should be Jesus. He will be an important person and do great things. At about the time Mary was expecting her baby, she and Joseph had to make a trip to a nearby town to pay their taxes. But since there were no trains, buses, or cars, Mary and Joseph had to walk. They headed out across the rugged countryside of Israel. The hills were steep, the night chilly. The only sounds came from the quiet rustling of sheep that the shepherds were tending on the rocky hillsides. Suddenly, Mary and Joseph approached a small town in the darkness. A little town called Bethlehem. <laughs> Mary and Joseph tried to find a place to stay that night, but all the hotels and inns were full. Finally, in desperation, they stopped and asked an innkeeper. Can we find a night in the bar? Yes, you may stay, but you'll need to sleep with my sheep, pigs, cows, and donkeys. And so they settled down for the night in the innkeeper's barn. In the middle of that very night, Mary gave birth to a baby boy and named him Jesus. She and Joseph wrapped the baby tightly in clothes and was the custom of that time and placed the baby gently into one of the bins where the cattle food is, a bin filled with hay and it's called a manger. What a gentle moment, what a special joy. The baby and his parents rested in the night, and all the soft sounds of the night and the animals were like a lullaby for the new little baby. It was clear from the beginning that this was no ordinary child. Above the stable where Jesus was born, something extraordinary was happening. And in the night sky, one star seemed to burn more and more brightly. And in the fields where the shepherds were tending their sheep, angels appeared in the sky. Angels that were proclaiming to all the world that a child born in a stable in Bethlehem was very, very special. It turned out that the shepherds were not the only people watching the bright star over Bethlehem that night. Three very wise people had been following it for some time.
believed that the star would lead them to a new baby who would someday grow up to be the king of kings. Because they believed they were on their way to the birth of the king, these three wise people carried gifts of gold and rare perfumes called frankincense and myrrh. They arrived after Jesus was born and presented him with their gifts. They saw the child they had been seeking and knew at once that they had found the right child. This baby, wrapped in swaddling cloths, born to poor parents, was indeed someone very special. The wise people fell upon their knees before the manger. Angels, shepherds, and wise people had all come to see the newborn king. Let us all remember their amazing stories as we sing, Come All Ye Faithful. Thank <laughs> you. 